the fucking, the old woman. By the way, this is the greatest hits thing if y'all <laughs> We're, we're, it, we, we were working for World Class in Dallas, the Von Erichs. Every two weeks, we'd go to Lubbock and Amarillo. And Lubbock and Amarillo under the Funks were great wrestling markets, but in, in 85, they'd kind of become an afterthought. And they were more like spot shows because everybody's concentrating on Dallas, and that's where the big money was. So you'd have maybe, you know, 700 or 800 or 1,000 people in Lubbock, which was a shitty crowd for wrestling in those days. And then you'd have maybe 1,500 in Amarillo or whatever. In an afternoon and evening show. So we're out there one day, and, and it was Lubbock at the old Civic Center. And I'm at ringside, and the match is going on. And really, we didn't even get a lot of heat in those towns. It just, they were kind of dead blase towns. Like El Paso, they fucking lynch you in the streets, right? <laughs> Lubbock and Amarillo at the time, so I wasn't expecting anything, but there was this one old woman where that cabinet is, right on the corner of the front row. And I'm doing something with the Fantastics, I don't know, and I've somehow, I've fucked with Bobby Fulton some kind of way, and this woman has been shaking her fist at me all day long. <laughs> and finally, they got the, once again, these are the, like the light plastic chairs, like a, you know, a fucking lawn wedding reception or something, just the folding little light plastic chairs. I'm at the ring and finally this woman's had it up and she gets up and she takes her chair and she, I'm not strong enough to lift this. <laughs> but imagine I have a plastic folding chair in my hand. She gets up and she gets, and she's so decrepit. <laughs> and she picks this chair up and she's coming toward me. <laughs> and I look, I'm like, am I supposed to run from this? <laughs> they going to bury me if I run from her. Already the cops going to come out there just watching. <laughs> and she's getting closer. And apparently from the look in her eyes, <laughs> she means to, to hit me with all the force she can muster with this fucking 12 ounce plastic chair. <laughs> and I can't, what am I going to do anything, right? But, so I just, when she comes up, and I'm like, stop her as she goes to swing. I just put my hand up to block the chair. Well, the switch and the momentum causes this whole woman to fall back in my face. <laughs> Goddamn, this woman 